Hi, I'm Dave Taylor, and you know what? I'm not a huge fan of housework. Actually, the thing I like the least is laundry, but don't have any solution for laundry yet. What I do have is I do have a Dyson DC39 vacuum cleaner that they sent me to review, so you know. And this thing just rocks. Let me show you. This is a Dyson DC39, and you can see it's pretty futuristic looking, and as is characteristic of Dyson, Lots of hinges on everything, and including here, you can see this is hinged, and then this has a fairly complicated connection. There's a lot of different ways this thing can turn. Easy to take things on and off, easy to make them longer, and in terms of using it, I like using my foot, so there we go. And now you've seen me clean my teeth, now you can see me vacuuming. Um, this thing's pretty darn impressive, I gotta say. Let me turn it off so I can talk a little more. So even if you look here, you can see this is multiple layers of pipe. This isn't just a single um, pipe here. And I have a Sears Kenmore that I bought that was the highest rated vacuum cleaner in Consumer Reports. And you know what? This thing kicks its butt. Hang on a sec, let me get my face on here. So there you have it. That's a pretty cool vacuum cleaner. And I gotta say, it's light enough that my kids can carry it upstairs, which for me is a big advantage. And, because <laughs> I want them to do the vacuum cleaning. And this thing just absolutely is just really good at sucking. I guess that's what you're supposed to say with a vacuum cleaner. And one more thing I'll say is that because it doesn't use a bag, I'm much less reticent about vacuuming up things like dry cat litter that's come out of the litter box because all I have to do is just dump it in the garbage and I'm ready for the next batch. So there's no disposables. And in terms of its overall design and finish, they just have a really excellent fit and finish. Everything's really thick and high quality. All the connectors feel like they're gonna last forever. And just the overall vacuum just feels like something where I'll be handing this down to my kids. So is it expensive? Yeah, they're kind of expensive, but what I will say is that I think, having now had a couple of weeks with this, it's totally worth it. And, you know, if I have my way, I'll go ahead and either give away or sell my old Sears Kenmore and just use the Dyson from this point on. So, if you're looking for a vacuum cleaner, I gotta say, you really need to go and give the Dyson a test run. They are expensive, but holy cow, I think it's definitely worth it. So, this is Dave Taylor with another handy housework tip. Really? Housework? Oh well, gotta do it. So, thanks for watching.